class students hope everyone are fine safe at home doing well yes in the last class which we have completed our exercise 3.4 and i told you to please practice those problems which ever we have done in our class so i hope you are practicing well at home so today we will continue with our next topic that is our common multiples so before going ahead i request everyone to please open your third book class book and pencil so you first open your third book page number 39 page number 39 okay see what is this same like common factors where the fact first we have found factors then we have written what are the common among them same here instead of factors we are writing multiples nothing but the table supposing we have taken 3 find it 3 comma 6 find the common multiples of 3 and 6 so what i write firstly i write the table of 6 what is one 3 versus 3 2 to the 6 3 is the positive one plus the thing so on till 30 and then for 6 and then i'll check what are the common numbers common numbers among those two so what are the common numbers those are nothing but our common multiples see here instead of that there are some other examples in page number 39 please look in your book the multiples of 4 and 6 are here 4 4 is what see what are the multiples of 4 Four is a four. Four is a eight. Four is a twelve. Four is a sixteen. Four is a twenty. Twenty-four. Twenty-eight. Thirty-two. Thirty-six. And so on. Let me see. Six, six, twelve, eight, twenty-four, and so on. So the common multiples of both four and six. Common multiples of both four and six. So here yeah, first let us write multiples of four as four. Eight. Four is a sixteen. Four is a twenty. Four is a twenty-four. Four is a twenty-eight. Four is a thirty-two. And so on. Okay. Next is four six. Right? Six six. Yes, yeah, so eight is four, 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 eight is This is uh, among the multiples of four and six. The common multiples are two and twenty-four. So that one more will be thirty-six. Okay. Next, see here least common multiple. Common multiples of both four and six are twelve, twenty-four, and thirty-six. So least same like here. See here where we have written highest among the common factors. Here the least, the lowest among the common multiples. So among the common multiples, which is the least one, yes, that is two well. So the LCM of four and six is two well. Okay, least of them is two well. That means two well is the lowest among the common multiples of both four and six. So LCM that is lowest common multiple of four and six is two well. So here they have given a small example that is on bells. How many times are uh, at the same end? After how many minutes the bell rang at same time? So please look into that and see. About your next, let us see what is the LCM. The least common multiple of two or more given numbers is the lowest of their common multiple. Same like the highest common factor is the highest number among all the common factors. Here also the same. The lowest LCM is the lowest number among all the common multiples. Okay. So what next is same like LCM. We have two methods. First is prime factorization method, and second one is Continue division method. Here to find LCM, there are two methods. That is, prime factorization method and second is division method. Okay. Let us see what is prime factorization method. The LCM of 36 and 16 can be found by prime factorization method as follows. Firstly, we have written the factors. Then say common factors. What are the common numbers among them? And then We have multiplied the extra factor. If you remember the last year to find LCM by prime factorization method, we have written LCM is equal to HCM into product of HCM into product of remaining factors. Yes or no? This is what the same. Just they have changed the sentences and remaining factors. Okay. This year they have just written the thing is. LCM is formed by product of all common prime factors. Product of all common factors where do we write in LCM, right? Next is and extra prime factors of both. Extra prime factors are nothing but remaining factors, right? 
So this is what fine factorization method. What is fine factorization for finding LCM? First we will write factors, then we will write the LCM means sorry the common factors. Then we will find the which is the least among them. Okay, least among them. Then it is for multiples. We will find the least. When it comes to prime factorization method, we will write the common factors. We will multiply the common factors and the remaining or the other extra factors. We will all together we will multiply and then we will find the LC. Okay. Next, what is one more method? Page number forty-one. Division method. See, to find the LCM of 24 and 90, see, uh, where is coming to continue division method, we have used two numbers, we have, we made one as divisor and one as dividend and we have found the answer, is that the last divisor is the answer, right? But whereas your division method is like, we will combine the two numbers and we will divide at a time with the same divisor. See here, for 24 and 90, they have written, they have made the division in the same column, same way. See 2 12 is 24, 2 45 is 19, 3 4 is 12, 4 15 is 45. So, so on. So, what is the LCM of 21 and 35 and 40? Sorry, 24 and 90 is when you multiply 2 into 3 into 4 into 50, the answer is 360. That is the LCM. Okay, by using division method. So, so now here it is for two numbers. When it is come for three numbers, in here you write all the three numbers at a time and we will divide it. So, to find LCM again, there are two methods. What are those methods? First one is fine factorization and second one is division method. LCM is having, before writing LCM, first thing you should write what is common multiples. Right? Where we write multiples, then we will find the common among them. And which is the least one, that is our LCM. Next method is prime factorization method. And third method is division method. So, what you are going to do? See, page. <coughs> okay, see page number 14. Here they have given the bold letters, two lines are there that you write, uh, write keep the heading LCM and write down that complete statements. And then you write there are two, there are, there are three methods of finding LCM. That is, first one is common multiple method, second one is prime factorization method, and the third one is division method. First one is multiple method, second one is prime, and third one is division method. Then after writing this, now keep open your class work, write exercise 3.5. First, we write down the complete heading of the first bit in your notes, and then we'll start. Okay. So exercise 3.5, exercise 3.5, first way. Exercise 3.5, first Convenient for us to circle here and we write common factors. 
So what is the common here? Common is only three. Common factors of twelve comma fifteen is equal to how much? Three. So there is that is only one. Now we have to find the LCM of twelve comma fifteen is equal to what we have to do? We have to multiply. The common factors with the remaining factors. We we said that uh, just now I said we can get LCM with the product of remaining factors, right? Now what is LCM highest? To find the highest, is, is there any other number? If this is a single number, so that's why three into what are the remaining factors? We have two into two into five. Two into two into five. So three twos are six. Six twos are twelve. Twelve fives are sixteen. Yes. So LCM of twelve comma fifteen is how much? It is sixteen. Okay. I hope did you get it. Next. So which one shall you? Okay, the last one because similar to last one that is fifth one is there. Okay. So that we can easily do. I hope you are clear with this. We have why we have multiplied this. Uh, Because we can, I say we can write LCM also, but there is no other number here to find to see which is the highest. So simply we have written three into another number. No, okay. So let us go with the next last one.
Sorry, this is 26 now. Oh, sorry. This is 26. 26, 14, 19. 26, this is. So, this will be given. So, in two table we start. Two ones are two. Two three are six. Again, 30 is nine. 30 is nine. Now what we have here? 30 into 2. We have 30. 2 times 2, 2 times 7. Also 2 times. Nothing but 2 into 7 into 30. So, common this is equal to 2 into 7 into 30. So 2 into 7 into 30. 2 sets of 14. 14 into 30. 14 into 30. The fours are 12. The other three gives us one is 4. Into 1 fours are 4. 1 1 is 1. 2 8 1. So 1 8 2 is the S. LCM of 26. 14, 19, 1 is equal to 182. Okay. Next. I hope it's very clear what is what we have learned. We have to write what is the definition of LCM, what are the three methods for finding LCM, and from first bit you can write second and third one. So what is your homework? Write. Definitions from page 13, from page 40, and first bit D and C, D comma C. So let us end this class today. So soon we will be in our next class. Till then, take care.